Good afternoon and welcome to another video by Roy Share UK. Right, more recently uh, I've been talking about local councils and, and it's to do with what they are doing or providing for us drivers during this uh, pandemic we're going through right now. Uh, if you watched the last video, we were talking about Wolverhampton City Council and how they're going about reducing the fees uh, for their drivers. Right, and on today's video, we're going to talk about Bradford Council. And they have gone one better, actually. And what they are doing is they're proposing to fund driver vehicle safety screens for their drivers. You can see that just there. And not only this uh, screens itself, that they also will give 10 uh, face masks to go along, alongside with two bottles of sanitizing gel. There you go. Now, one thing to remember is this is the actual local council uh, that's providing this, uh, not the company they work for. Obviously, if you're working for Uber, I've done a few videos where they were doing the same thing, apart from the screen, of course. Uh, mm -hmm. But this is a local, uh, the council actually doing it, which is, you know, makes it a lot more worthy. Now, I'm not sure how they're actually doing this, but far as I know, what they, what the council or the Bradford Council are doing is they're going to, uh, they're going to have a designated company which they will use. So also at the same time, this is not something you could actually go direct to them. I don't think this is where your local base. So if you're working for a, a base, they will contact that designated company. And uh, for instance, and if if that you know if that base had hundred drivers, they would contact the company and say, look, you know, we need hundred packages, and um, then the drivers will come to the um, come to the, the base and collect um, the equipment. Right. One thing to mention also, like all the councils, they're all saying, you know, we st start needing to start wearing a face mask, and uh, I think. Every council is recommending that at the same time. Uh, the other thing I want to say, I personally don't think they will be actually installing these screens for you. So you might have to do that yourself, which is a bit of a shame, really, because if they did that, I think that would have made them stand out way, way ahead of everyone else. But at the same time, they're saying, look, you know, this is quite easy to install, uh, however they do it. Um, Another thing to also remember is that you need to contact your insurance company to let them know that you do have this um, safety uh, safety screen uh, installed in your vehicle. Um, far as I know, they're all giving this go ahead. Uh, so, but if you do mention that the council has given it um, given the go ahead, I think you know you do stand off getting approved um, by just mentioning the council as well. Now, however you're looking at this, you know, we have to applause uh, Bradford Council in their thinking about driver's safety. And more importantly as well, at the same time, you know, this is also minimizing um, further expense for drivers because a lot of these, uh, a lot of us drivers already spending, um, you know, up to three, four hundred pounds in some circumstances of getting this uh, screen um, installed and we don't even know if they actually work right so you know a big thank you for Bradford Council unlike other councils um, within the country you know you look at TFL God, they're just too busy you now thinking of increasing um, the central London fee I think it's going up to £25 a day now as well so that's what they concern TFL. They're, they're just money, money orientated uh, thinkers down there. Birmingham City Council, same thing. The problem with Birmingham City Council is they're too big of a council to even implement these kind of things. The whole structure of, the, of this council is totally uh, wrong. Um, I don't know, Manchester, complete waste of time that council is. Uh, when it comes to doing something like this for the drivers. Uh, I suppose the other one <laughs> is the Leeds Council. You know, this is uh, Bradford's neighbouring council, Leeds Council. You know, they're just sitting on the backside, you know, just pretending that nothing's really happening across the road, you know, and they should be really ashamed of themselves. 
Um, so this is what this video is about. Well done, Bradford Council, and let's hope um, other councils uh, follow the suit. I'll speak to you guys again. Bye-bye now.